so hi everyone welcome to my youtube channel so in this video we will discuss about the case at 2023 exam preparation so study plan for 60 days so within uh, 60 days you have to prepare the prepare for the exam so how you have to plan uh, for the study according to this given time so as we know the exam is going to be conducted on 5th of november so if we approximately take 60 days hope uh, some have started uh, this uh, already they have started so if we consider 60 days plan study plan so we have two papers general paper and another one will be core subject so general paper what are the concepts that you need to concentrate and also how many days you have to give for general paper so first you should understand what will be the topics that will be involved in general paper teaching aptitude okay related to teaching and learning process so some questions will be there research aptitude so how to conduct the research and what are uh, the procedures or research proposal how to write thesis writing research ethics you are going to study comprehension uh, it will show you how you are going to understand the concept they will give some para you have to solve and ask the questions on that communication so the communication skills uh, they are going to evaluate some of the grammatical questions will be there mathematical reasoning and aptitude so some uh, concepts related to problem solving will be there logical reasoning and data interpretation also information and communication technology people development and environment then about higher education system so all these topics you have to study for the general paper in the given limited time so as they have given instruction here five questions each carrying two marks are to be set from each model so if there are 10 sections or 10 topics are there from each topic two marks question will be asked uh, that will be for five questions so if we consider five questions uh, from each topic five into ten so 50 marks we can say so this paper will be for 50 marks uh, then each carrying two marks then general paper if we give 50 days time uh, among 60 days then uh, each day you have to read daily one topic you have to read okay and try to solve the previous year question paper then uh, after completing the process or reading all the 10 topics and solving the previous year question papers do the revision okay so very important revision is very important so you have to give 15 days time for it and go through the previous year question papers and also try to do the revision at the end so this is about uh, general paper then what about core subject so if you are physical science student you already know that uh, according to syllabus they have given nine sub, uh, core subjects so if you give 40 days time for physical science paper then each uh, subject you have to give 5 days okay and uh, you can see which are the core subjects mathematical method of physics classical mechanics electrodynamics quantum mechanics thermodynamic and statistical physics electronics and experimental methods so these three papers are included in section a but other three subjects uh, atomic and molecular physics condensed matter physics nuclear and 
particle physics are included in paper B along with these subjects. So each paper you have to give five days, forty-five days time, and uh, the uh, books that you have to refer for each topic I have mentioned here for uh, MMP. H K Das is one of the good book. Classical mechanics, Goldstein. Electrodynamics, Griffith or B B Lord. Quantum mechanics, Arul Das. Thermodynamic and statistical physics, D A Macquarie. Electronics and experimental methods, H S Kalsi. And atomic and molecular physics, H B White. Condensed matter physics, or we can call solid state physics, C Kittel. So nuclear and particle physics, D C Thayer. Anyhow, time is very limited. But if you want to go to the specific topic, if you want to understand, just you can refer some of the books. If you don't have much time, then you can just go to the selected topics. If you read all the concepts, you are not going to uh, cover, uh, or you are not going to. Give your best. So uh, try to select easiest concepts and the concept that you can understand well. So you have to do a smart work here. Not uh, if you are planning for forty five days. So only go to the selected topics. First of all, what you have to do previous year question papers. So very important. If you go to the previous year question papers, then you will going to understand how the questions will be asked. According to that, you can plan your study. As I told, five days, one topic, and after reading all the subjects, important topics, then do the revision. Okay, as I told, selected topics you have to read for a given time. other uh, then only you can able to crack this exam okay within a given time so this is a very good opportunity for you and i wish you all the best and hope uh, this information is helpful for you if you like this video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for upcoming notifications thank you for watching